Hey guys, how's everybody doing? Video number two for me today. My uh, I got my deformed group build build done. Put on the, that was put on by Papa Dan and Colonel Reb. I might even be able to get another another one in. I got a couple of uh, I got a couple of the tune um, model kits. I might I might do so. But this is the little stogie, a little stogie AMT kit that uh, Neiman Chambers sent me. Um, I had a blast building this. I really had a blast building this. It, uh, it, it come out pretty cool as far as I'm concerned. So, uh, yeah, I did a few things to it. Uh, a little scratch building here and there. I, um, added some work to the, um, yeah. To the corner store the top. I, uh, did a lot of stuff work to this. I added some balsa wood and some tissue paper, and um, yeah, we did some. Uh, I think it came out pretty good. Um, <laughs> it was a lot of fun. So, without further ado, let's go take a look. Oh, all right. Oh. Ah, all right, boys, hang on, hang on. Oh, look, look. Jesus Christ. All right, here it is, the little stogie. The little stogie. <laughs> here it is, fellas. There it is. We uh, use some uh, ballpoint pen springs. That uh, it does work. Rear end, same thing. There's the tissue paper and the balsa wood. Um, I wired the motor. I actually, I, I did the wiring like that on purpose. I kind of wanted to make it look like a tumbleweed. You know what I mean? Kind of tumbleweedish. Uh, we did the whole frame and wood grain. I figured it's a Conestoga wagon. It's going to be mostly wood. Um, Made our own lantern in the back. Uh, I took uh, a couple of uh, lenses from a, a truck model. The straw, the one in uh, amber and red, glued them together. Put all our tools, all our tools on. There's our racks. There's our, I'm sorry. There's our pick. There's our racks. Our shovel. Yeah, real, real happy how this came out, fellas. Very happy how this came out. Uh, we can actually, we can, if we want to go to town, we want to take our chicken to town. We can drop the top and uh, go go rider style. So <laughs> it just cracks me up. It really cracks me up. Uh, I told Mrs. Mac I definitely want another one of these kits. Yeah, there's our shifter. Uh, that was supposed to be a horse head. And I was like, no. And there's our little jug of bourbon when we go into town. Our fuel tank and battery. Little beer keg there. But uh, very, very happy how this came out, man. I had a blast building this. Uh, I want to thank, really want to thank Papa Dan and uh, Colonel Reb Tom for putting this on. This is This is a great build, man. Really a great build. So I got another couple. I'm going to see if I can get another one in. Um, I got uh, I got a, a Meng tank. And I got a couple of the... A uh, couple of ships and... Uh, um, from the uh, Toon build. So we'll see what happens. There it is though, fellas. I think the wood grain frame come out pretty cool. Uh, that was all my work. Um... This up here did come with the wood grain on it. You know, the body and the uh, interior, the barrels. But the frame wasn't. The frame was all, uh, that's all me. I think, I think it would come out pretty cool. Same thing with the motor. Uh, they had, this motor was not wired and it just had four um, stacks on either side sticking straight up. And I, uh, I was like, no. So that's a Protect. 
carburetor with a Spiriva uh, intake. 2H knows what I'm talking about when I say the Spiriva intake. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we got it coiled up. But uh, very cool build, man. I had a lot of fun with this. Really had a lot of fun with this. So let me know what you think, boys. Let me know what you think. We'll give it another one more look with the top down. We'll take the top down and we'll go to town. There we go. <laughs> oh, man. Cracks me up. Got our gun. Never, never go unarmed. All right, fellas. Let me know what you think. Appreciate it. We'll talk later. Peace out.